I got some mods and stuff to do. He can't be here. Uh, we're going to take the car to do some things and stuff like that. It's going to be all exciting and stuff like that because you know how it is. Tahoo. No, this is just covered in plastic. I'm back. So, gonna finish this brake booster brake right now. While Blake does some editing on the lappy, good work, Blake. Smashing, smashing out the vlogs. All right. So as you can see, I got some stuff out, some items I'm gonna have to use. This is where I got up to the other day. Sure, the welds aren't uh, that pretty, but. Hey, it should work. I'm going to clean it up and paint and do all that stuff, obviously, later. Went out and purchased a Rivnut gun because I was over borrowing someone else's. So we got one of them for Project Driveway. Got some hardware, like I said I was going to do. Um, so the next step I'm up to right now is I'm going to drill out this hole here and this hole here, which will be the mounting holes for this um, brace to go in. And now that I'm thinking of it, how far is this nut so going to stick out is the question. It should hopefully be okay. I might have to uh, recess it in there. No, actually, wrong. The nut so will go on this side, so it's all good. It's all good, guys. Nut so there, which will go on the wheel well. It'll go in here and in here. And look who's rocked up. Is that, is that Callum in, in the work wagon? Hey, did you hear what's happened to the toaster tonight? No. Hi. No? Ooh, are you coming? Or what? Yeah, I'm what? Excited. Yeah, I'm, I'm actually really excited for tonight. So, oh. I got some mods and stuff to do. He can't be here. Uh, we're going to take the car to do some things and stuff like that. It's going to be all exciting and stuff like that because you know how it is. All right, so once again, someone rocked up. So, I'm having a break. Step three. Probably trying. Anyway, we got some mods to do. Like, got everything set out. Got broken dock over there, so he's just gonna monitor me as I do some things. I'm gonna, you know what? I'm gonna take the wheel off because I want to make sure these two bolts here or these two holes that I'm gonna use are in the right spot. And to get to it is my wheel. Look at these. I put these things on the other day. I'm so surprised I haven't been capped. In one of our earlier videos, I got capped. Early, yeah. early video because I was like, Blake, I got capped. Legit, like some little. Kid on a push bike oh, must have right taken more. All right, now we can see the two holes that I need to access, which is one and two. So I'm gonna get the dock to give me a hand. All right, bro, you can pull it out. Cal, you moved. You definitely moved a lot. I did only because I wanted to make sure I had me, but it didn't realize how close the edge that right, was. Now we're gonna start again. Oh, you're drilling holes in your bench, mate. Hey! They're brand new! Oh, is that easier? Blake's got some other things to get on with because it's uh, getting dark How soon. To put my seats in. He's gonna put his seats in and stuff for things that we're gonna do tonight. Um, but my plate is all made up. It's all cool looking and stuff. So I've welded it. I've cleaned up the edges. I've drilled these two holes, which are the mounting holes. This hole is I'm hoping in the right spot. I've just drilled that hole, which was a bit hard to line up and stuff. Um, and down here, we've not inserted one and two river nuts in with the washer because it was a little bit undersized. I've just dropped my thing, but that's all right. So, uh, and also we had to move 
this guard and my computer and stuff like that because the rear knock gun just was not going to fit so i'm hoping all i have to do is bolt this guy in there run that that stop thing that i've dropped down there the um adjustable we'll say we'll, we'll call it the adjustable brake booster brace stopper adjustable <laughs> um yeah so that's gonna go there so let's put it all together and then if it's all good i can put my car back together help blake and this can get painted um in a day or two we're gonna have a little bit more time on my hands so let's do that real quick it is all in we're done up in a bit of paint so it's solid one two mount a little foot stopper adjustable so i just had a 13 mil spanner there and then 18 mil spanner on that nut to tighten up between the brake booster and my brace and then on the back side with these ugly welds because i didn't grind the gal back um i just got another nut so then that just locks all that in and then on this side you got the two rev nuts in there she looks pretty good with the burnt edges. plenty plenty um the color the color on the burnt edges like how it goes yeah. through and then goes to like brown yeah you've... you know what I might even just heat the whole thing up with the oxy, get it to all colour up, yeah. and I'll leave it like that, and then gulf coat and I might even just clear it like that because it will rust. Oh, that's right. You you ground back most of the gulf, didn't you? Yeah, for yeah. welding because the first time I didn't. That's why all the inside. So, Callum's gonna or the doctor, he's gonna hold the camera. And he's gonna show us how much flex. If my you know day or afternoon and a bit has been worth it. Put your boot into it, come on, mate. Anymore. Mate, the only reason why that's flexing because that little rubber doodad on the end of the thing is flexing, but it's like not even a mil. Yeah. So it's, how much? How much do you reckon we've? Uh, oh, that's easy. Like nearly a hundred, like nearly a hundred percent. It's like probably like a ninety percent takeoff. Yeah. So we're, of your flex, yeah. It's, it's stopped ninety percent of the flex, which is golden. So we've actually. I don't want to say that's better than what you could buy. You can. You reckon? I don't know. So I was gonna get a beat rush one. I like their products. They're pretty cool, and I like the gold on and whatnot. I think it was it was about a hundred plus US. I didn't really look for the cheapest price, but I just found one. Um, and then that's what I thought of the idea. Like, why don't I just make one? So I made my own design and whatnot. Um, that has worked great. Out, so I just gotta do something about clearing it and stopping rust and put all this stuff back together. I gotta put this back on and the computer back on and all of that stuff. And then tools away. And then we're gonna help Blake because Blake has got some exciting things to do. We're getting tuned, mate. Tuned? Did you say that again? What? T <laughs> exactly. So, new turbo, new exhaust, new bits and pieces all over the golden toaster, yeah. and we can finally do... Put them together, mate. Put it, put it all together, yeah. So, we're going to go down for a tune later tonight. Blake will get into a bit more details of that side of things because we've got to do some things before we head out tonight um the things that i know we need to do we need to put this exhaust on he wants to paint a little piece up there and whatnot so we need to finish exhaust well, finish exhaust put it all back together yeah, stuff like that done. All, all we've got to do left is because when we welded the flange on the dump pipe um just spray a bit of paint on that on them welds while while we're here instead of me taking it off somewhere down the track because it's because it's rusted rusty yeah so ah. might as well do it now while while we're here and why yeah. not to touch it again Hopefully. yeah so i literally gotta slap some paint on dump pipe. the dump pipe put just slap the exhaust back in nuts and bolts it's all that's yeah. it he's done all the hangers and stuff he did a real good job with that paint it as well to prevent some more rush mm. then blake's already put the back seats in because yeah. they haven't been in since track day yeah they're in which pretty cool i do like the look of the fozzy fat rear seats yeah i, know I don't know do. why it just looks cool from the rear i'm like if that <laughs> with like um like Half roll cage. Yeah. I don't know how it look with half roll cage or full roll cage, but that can be later down the track. Yeah, that's like we got. Or even, what about just a half cage with two long bars? Just Ooh. Yeah. yeah, that would look pretty cool. Who knows? The cart, the golden toaster might end up getting that, getting that far one day. So, you know, safety is a priority. That, yeah. You can never put a price on safety. So anything you can put in your car to make it better, even if it makes it slower or sh look stupid or whatever, you, if it's legal. Yeah and functional functional and it just keeps you safe what's between you and the road rubber. the ground bit of rubber yeah bit of rubber so you slide off that rubber Whew. 
Yep, dead. Whew. So you want something in there to stop you, but that's another story. I uh, gotta put the rear bar on. Yep. And then you needed to cut a little yeah, section or something it. because this big ass thing. Look at it. Pot. Yeah, we it's... don't want it, don't want it burning. Yeah, so I just gotta cut a little bit out of the bar just to make it fit instead of lighting me rear bar on fire. Um, which is over there. Hello. Yeah. And then last step is there only one more step? Uh, wide band. Wide band. Yeah. Let's get into it. Wide band. Did I? Are you excited? Car's gone the road. <laughs> hey, waited a little bit for this. Oh, right, here you go. Clean that up. Do you want sandpaper? Yeah. Okay. Look at that. Here we go. Bad boy. Multi gauge wide band AFR. Pretty cool. Hey, did they get to see this in one of the other episodes? Yeah. Yeah, I think you did. A long time ago. Yeah, good couple dead exhaust, but it's finished. We're moving on with our lives, so that's gonna go in. Got the Dremel out for the rear bar. Yeah. That's all right, now we can move on to bigger and better projects. Good boy. Alright. That's done. That's good enough. So as you can see, it's it's still a bit of light out here. But didn't rust too much actually. Nah, it's good. I'm gonna paint the sponge too. Yeah. Some, some do, you, do you want some tape? Yeah. Okay, tape I'll tape. get some tape. Thanks, bro. Look at those welds we did. Jokes. <laughs> <laughs> I wish, bro. Imagine that. Hey, our welding's getting better, though. It is. Yeah, mine came off alright on that brace. Yeah, it did. From last week. Yeah. yeah. So, I could be a bit clean. What colour are you going, Blake? What colour would you like out of the selection of. Uh... Black and black? But yeah, yeah, what type of black? No undercoat, just straight black. Gloss. Straight gloss. Yeah. Alright. Back over to the part shelf. It's getting dark real quick. Blake's got the first coat on, just slapping it on real quick. That's what we want. We even did this one because like, you know what, while we're here, we might as well do it because we 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 are got our fingers crossed. This is the last time this has to come out. Hey Blake, should you like I know it's stainless on this side, but I don't know. Like no, that's from the leak. Yeah? Ah, yeah, oh, from, from, previ pre yeah. from previous episodes on yeah, Project Driveway. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think so. that might be stainless. Nah, it is stainless. Yeah. Yeah. What's this one? Goes that's, my asshole. That's like a tap out. Yeah, I don't I, I, I've never used one of these in my life. I have no, no? idea. No? Why is that a plastic wheel? Because that goes straight over there. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. And you got some, got some polishing wheels and stuff. Don't drop them. That's shatter. Yeah, and this thing's like, I don't know, how much RPMs? It's on the lowest. It's not Oh, it's currently off. Oh, we just got on and off, no trigger. Yeah. Yep. All right, so we're up to the stage of cutting the rear bar. And once again, it is getting dark. We can, I can actually see the first star of the night. It's up there. You guys probably can't see that, but I certainly can. I certainly can. Blake's trying to, yep. That's exactly how it goes. Do you need a screwdriver, bro? No, I'm just gonna put this on. It's probably come with one, hopefully. Um, it came with a little spanner. But at the other end of the spanner, you know what it is, Blake? A freaking screwdriver. Mate, Bunnings, you've done it again. <laughs> um, is that right. Mita 10? Mita 10? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that was such a rip off of Mita 10. <laughs> all right, Blake's just going for it. He's just drawing a rough line of where he thinks it's gonna be in the way, and then we'll put it on and we'll see. Put my safety glasses on. You ready? Yep. <laughs> How's that taste? Right in my lips. I don't know where that went, but I'm so glad that didn't hit me or you. <laughs> that bent that shaft. Fuck. No, it didn't. I think it just came out. Yeah, for real? That, because that, oh, yeah. Alright. Where'd you put the rest of the stuff? No, in the boot. Oh, my knee's no good like that. Whew. That was close. Use the tool to tighten it, bro. Did you use the tool to tighten it? You didn't, did you? No, I didn't know. Oh, come on. We, we talked about this. The multi-tool. Screwdriver slash spanner. There we go. Now it 
hopefully shouldn't come out as easy. Oh, the what? The gear inside of it. Are we good? Oh, Ooh, don't do that! <laughs> <laughs> now you would have worn the gear down. The pin that drops in there. Uh, That's all it is. Yeah. Alright, well we'll test fit it. Because yeah, yeah, we might need to take a little bit more out. So let's do that now. Yeah. Okay. How's your head? Burnt. No. Is it just covered in plastic? Uh, it's actually mostly on your glasses somehow. Yeah, I don't know where that came from, but okay. Oh well. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Have I just got like empty? Nah. Empty glasses. You like. can't really say it's dark, dude. We got two lights on, it's real dire. It'd be, it'd be like static to my face too. Probably. Blake's under the car, smashing back in the dump pipe. It's all dried up. Is your gasket up here, mate? Ready for you? Yeah, look, gasket's up here, beautiful. So he's gonna put that in, then we're gonna put this. Dude, that looks really nice, man. The pipe. Yeah. Mid pipe. That came up real good. Yeah, so he's gonna smash that guy back in then we can put the diff back back on put the bar back on start the wire band and get out of here because we're uh not that we're running out of time but we just don't have time to waste sort of thing because we're still going to do a couple things before we get out on the road and stuff like that and it's uh, it's a bit of a drive not too far how you going blake yeah need a hand um you can start doing the top oh i'll do the top so i'm gonna have to put the camera down and come on guys you've already seen all this stuff yeah, hundred times you know there's five bolts is it five i'm pretty sure it's five five, two, five bolts three, or not five, yeah. yeah see that's how many times i've done it i know <laughs> <laughs> one side down of the exhaust damn that sits so low like when you have it up so high you're like yeah you get used to it being that high how'd you get that out Last time we had to be on timbers to get that out. Because it sits on the headers. You gotta get that point. Remember the point because we uh, Yeah. Head over. Uh, no, back you can get it How strong are you feeling, bro? Dude, don't do that. Please don't do that. That's how I put a dint in my door. You're gonna have to be a lot higher and a lot stronger. And your name's not Matt. Oh, you know oh. put that. <laughs> let's go, let's go! Watch the wheel! I'm good, bruh! Oh, there we go. Oh. There's no time for step three. Nah. Oh. Oh. We're going to jack it up, so I'm going to have to put the camera down because we're going to work quickly. Blake's just ripping off the exhaust shielding for the factory exhaust. And then he's just going to zip this bit off here, this plate. Uh, if you go up at your end. Nah, nah, exhaust. Yeah, you had to do this backwards, Blake. You're not going to get that up. Don't have much time, boy. Run down of time. Blake's just going hack at the moment. But that's alright, we've got something else planned for this section of rear bar. Oh, he's cranking it up. After a stressful last hour, maybe hour and a half, we got everything done. Wire bands on, uh, which is a bit of yeah, things took a lot longer than expected due to obviously rushing, leaving things too late. But that's probably my part because my mods from the week previous, I just saw a shooting star, bro. That was pretty cool. Um, yeah, so my mods ran over, then put Blake a little bit back. So we're going to get down, get this tune, and then we'll probably pick you guys up after the tune is completed. Because, um, yeah, we're just going to get down there and stuff. You don't want to see us driving. That's boring. I don't want to see us driving in the dark. So it's all good. It's all running. Off to the petrol station. We go. Yeah, I think I got everything. There's a nice shiny gauge in there, but we'll show you guys later. Have you got a thing in your car? I do have a thing in my car. No, no, I'll be back. Good work, pizza boy. All right, we just got some air in the tires because I'll set it like. 30 from track day um two psi so fix them up get some juice best feeling on a friday is a full tank we all know it off to go get the tune isn't that right blake isn't that right blake blake isn't that right oh my god blake answer me blake answer me there we go off to go get the tune the looney tunes and i got my milk 
push up. I spark because I'm hungry. I'm in all day. But starving. While you're at home, uh, while you're all at home, I'm hungry. My life with no food sucks. Here he comes. Probably can't see me, but. Oh, when's we're in the tunnel, bro? Yeah. Oh, 60. Got a 60. That's alright. Hey, guess what? We're all done. I know, bro. We're all tuned up. Yeah. Wide bands all working. We're running late, mate. No. Yeah. On D cell, mate. All working. We're in the tunnel. We've got to go for a tunnel run with the new exhaust. It seems like it's, a different car, man. No, it's not loud as in the sense of the volume, as in like it's I've got the basic, volume all the way yeah. up. It's just like Base. fucking loud. <laughs> in a weird bassy. Yeah. Oh my god. I scared the god. shit out of it. I thought that was a wine. I thought, oh, you hear that pop? Oh. Oh. Cruise 
around and see how we go. Who knows what happens. Hopefully find a good spot for a photo, just at least one photo. Hopefully, if not, oh well. It's not like the car's not gonna be off the road again. We've always got time to take another photo. But if we don't go out and get another photo, thank you very much for watching this episode. Uh, yeah. Goodbye. <laughs> See you. But yeah. No more exhaust pad. Thank oh, fuck. God damn, I took you freaking. I don't even know how long. I think like two and a half months. I was going through our videos. Really? Like, it was like two and a half, three That's months. That's sad. So sad. <laughs> but yeah, it's probably a bit dark. Oh, uh, yeah.